What's going on guys, Levkin here. Today I'll tell you what consequences await us if the Earth will suddenly stop spinning on its axis. Let's go. Let's start with the fact that in case the Earth will suddenly stop, several catastrophes will occur each one on its own being able to completely wipe out the human race. The speed that our Earth spins at is 1670 km per hour. That's why in case of a sudden stop, animals, humans, trees, buildings will be carried away from the Earth's surface. Imagine if you'd be driving a car at a speed of 1500 km per hour and the car would immediately stop. What would happen to you? Nothing good. And so is an immediate stop of the planet. Your body, if you would be near the equator, would carry on going east with a velocity of 1670 km per hour. Being closer to the poles would decrease your velocity. Because the minimum distance from the axis of the rotation is on the poles, people living close to them might be able to survive but their fortune would not last long because they will be terrorized by insanely severe storms. And since the oceans will continue spinning due to their momentum, the lucky survivors will get blasted by the tsunamis. The speed of the winds will get so high that the friction created by them will immediately create fires all over the earth. If anyone will survive their hell, they will only do so to get killed by numerous volcanic eruptions. After all, the earth is not solid. The Earth's crust is the same as the peel of an apple. Under the crust there is a liquid magma and the core that also spin. In case of an immediate stop, all the liquid substances will spin a few more times, smashing the Earth's crust. As a result of this, earthquakes so powerful will happen, with many kilometers of fractures and volcanic eruptions in places where they have never existed, it would be quite unlikely that anything alive will be left on this planet. As I said in the beginning of this video, each of the catastrophes that will occur her will be able to destroy humanity on its own. But the best part of it all is the fact that all of them will be falling humanity at the same time, meaning that the chances of our survival will not be just equal to zero, but to negative one. Of course, it's possible that everything will be even sadder. In case of a sudden stop of Earth rotation, tremendous kinetic energy of Earth and the momentum will rip it into small pieces. Astronauts on the orbit, however, will be cool. They will see a notable sight before their death. Now, let's imagine that the Earth will slow down over time, so that we won't get blown away to hell. Let's imagine that the Earth will slowly slow down over time and will stop completely in few months. What will happen then? You might think that in this case no disastrous events will happen. Wrong! A day will last for 375 days. On one side of the Earth, for almost half a year, the Sun will be up and it will be extremely hot, while on the other side it will be a 6 month freezing night. Most of the animals and plants won't be able to adapt to these changes and will simply go extinct. Their distribution of oceans and land will occur. Due to the lack of centrifugal force, the water will not seek the equator anymore. Scientific calculations show that only one main continent will be left, stretching out along the equator. Two massive oceans will be created, North and South. Most of the European countries, including Russia, Canada and Argentina, will go underwater. As you can see, Africa will be barely flooded at all. Think that people in Africa are lucky? Wrong again. They will suffer the most. You and I will die quickly, while they will be suffering from cancers due to the radiation. The thing is, in case the Earth will stop spinning, the core in the middle of our planet will stop spinning as well. Without the spin, the protective geomagnetic field will disappear. In this case, the solar radiation will kill everyone. Well, now I've got bad news for you guys. At the moment, the Earth is indeed slowing down its spinning speed. Due to the tidal forces between the Moon and the Earth, every 100 years a day becomes 2 milliseconds longer, which means that in 140 million years, one day will last for 25 hours. Likewise, I've got some good news for you. When the Earth will finally stop spinning completely, we won't be on this planet any longer, and it is very unlikely that it will have enough time to stop before it will be consumed by our Sun. Since in about 5 billion years, the star will turn into a red giant, will increase in size and will swallow our planet. Great, isn't it? If this video gets over 50 likes, I'll make another video on some similar topic. This is it for now, thank you for watching and remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. Also make sure to check out some of my other videos. See you next time.